La 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 la. Hi kids, how are you today? I'm Kent the elephant. Today we're going to learn all about numbers using a shape sorting clock. Ooh, how exciting! Are you ready? Right, here are the shapes with numbers in them. Now follow the blue arrow. What number is there? Five? No, not five. Could it be twelve? No, that one goes at the top. How about one? That's right. And it's a parallelogram. That's the name of the shape. Number one. Woohoo! Brilliant. I love number one. Do 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 do. <laughs> What's next? Number four? Nope. Is it number two? That's right. And what shape is it? It's a diamond. Number two. Woohoo! There it goes. <laughs> right, what's next? It's number three. Brilliant. It's a triangle. Three for me. Dee 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 dee. I just love it. Ooh. <laughs> right, what's next? Number ten. No. It is not. It is number four. Correct. Four comes after three. And what shape is it? Four is a rectangle. Perfect fit. Yes. Woohoo. You're doing it. You're doing it. Let's go again. It's number five. And what shape is it? It's five sides. It's called a pentagon. Great job. Oh, look. I'm balancing. Hmm, what number's next? Is it seven? No. How about number six? Yay! Six goes halfway down the clock at the bottom and it's an oval shape. Brilliant. Dee -dee -dee -dee. Like an egg, isn't it? Ooh. Hmm, <laughs> what's next? Number seven comes after number six. That's right. And it has six sides. It's called a hexagon. Yeah! Ooh, this is an interesting shape. Number eight. It's a plus sign. Number eight is a big plus for me. <laughs> oh, yay! Oh, yay! Oh, yay! Now we know this shape is not a square. Hmm. Is it number nine? It is number nine. Of course, nine comes after number eight. And the shape is a star. Like you, you are all superstars. Ah, number 10. Of course, I absolutely love number 10 because it's a love heart. Love, 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 love. 11 comes next. That's right. And do you know what shape it is? 11. It's a square. Brilliant. <gasps> Only one left to go now. Ooh. Number 12 goes at the top. And it's a circle. Well done. Number 12 is the last missing piece. Brilliant. Woohoo. Yeah. Wow, you're so clever, kids. You matched all the right shapes and the right numbers in the clock. Well done. Hello, everybody. It's Kent here. Kent the elephant. Look at me on my boat. Woohoo! Today, we're going to play Count the Sea Animals. Are you ready? Diving in with my snorkel. Wow. Amazing. Look, it's a clownfish. How many can you see? How many clownfish can you see? Are there four? Nope. Two? Uh uh. Three. Yes. One, two, three. There are three clownfish. Good counting. Off we go to find some more sea animals. Ooh, look here. How many can you see? Are there two? No, five. Uh -uh. Four? Yes, that's right. One, two, three, 
four. There are four seahorses! Yay! Let's go again! Bye bye, seahorses! Whee! So much fun! Ooh! Look at these sharks! Big fellows, aren't they? How many can you count? Five? No! Six? No! Two! <laughs> That's right! One! Two! Well done! There are two sharks! Good counting! Bye bye, Mr. Sharks! I love being under the ocean! Wow! How many wibbly wobbly jellyfish can you see here? Four? No. Three? No. How about five? Yay! <laughs> That's right. One, two, three, four, five. There are five jellyfish. Brilliant! This was so much fun. Let's do it again. Bye! La, 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 la. Hi kids, how are you today? I'm Kent the Elephant, yay! Today we're going to learn how to sort the trash. I'm so excited, woohoo! Can you see all the trash lying around the room? Now we've got four bins. What do we put in what bin? Hmm, a plastic bottle. That goes in, not that bin, but the purple bin for plastic and metal, yay! Well done! Next, we've got some screwed up paper. The paper bin is the orange bin. Well done. Oh, I remember I drew a picture on that. Now an apple core. Where should a food item go? In the green bin? Nope. In the blue compost bin. Yay, we can use it to grow other things. Now a bottle and this one is made of glass a glass bottle goes in the green bin green for glass yay i loved that drink next we've got a can of soda it's made from metal so which bin will it go in the paper bin no the plastic and metal bin yeah woohoo you're doing great now what's this oh it's my old book now where should that go? Glass? No, it's made from paper, the orange bin. Yay, oh, I used to love that book. Now we've got a banana peel. So that's food again. Do you remember where the food items go? Yay, in the compost. Ooh, ooh, banana, banana. Oh, look, a glass bottle. Which one is the glass bin? The green one, well remembered. Ooh, be careful with glass though. Now we have a popcorn box. Hmm, made from cardboard, which is a bit like, not plastic or metal, but paper, yeah, the orange bin. Ooh, I enjoyed that popcorn with our movie. Now we have a plastic wrapper. Hmm. Where should that go? Yay, in the purple bin for plastic and metal. Ooh, they were yummy. <laughs> Last but not least, we've got an old slice of watermelon. Ooh, delicious. Where does the food go? Nope, in the compost, the blue bin. Well done, kids. You did a great job clearing up all the trash in my room. Bye. Hey, kids, how are you today? I'm Kent the Elephant. Yay! Today we're going to learn how to paint farm animals. Do you want to paint with me? You do? Brilliant! Right, let's paint this first animal. Hmm, he's got two ears, two big eyes, a nose, a tongue sticking out, a lovely brown colour, red tongue, a blue collar, and gold tag. Hmm, which farm animal is this one? Can you tell me? That's right, it's a dog! D-O-G, dog! Let's go for the next one. Hmm, I know this one. A red bit at the top and under the beak. Hmm, this 
is a type of bird and it goes cluck, 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 cluck. It's kind of red orangey colour and we're shading it paler and paler towards the legs which are going to be yellow. It's a hand. Brilliant. Let's go for the next one. Ooh, this one lives on a pond. It's going to be yellow. Hmm, now what animal is this? She goes quack, 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 quack. Has a beak and wings. Another type of bird that lives on the pond. Hmm, it is a duck. Duck, duck, duck. Yeah. Ooh, meow. I know what this feline creature is. Pink in her ear and a lovely kind of peachy colour for the rest. Side to side, side to side. In fact, this farm animal you can paint any colour. Even you could put stripes on her. It's a cat. C -a -t -a. Meow. Ooh, this one is great. The name of this farm animal rhymes with meow. Do you know what it is? This one is white with brown patches, a bell round her neck, some horns, hooves, an udder where she gives milk. It's a cow. Moo. So we painted a dog, then we painted a hen, and a duck, and a cat, and finally a cow. Wow. Well done, kids. You were amazing. You did such a great job! See you next time! In my little garden Oh, hello there! I didn't see you! How are you today? I'm Kent, the elephant! Yay! And I'm in my garden! I love being in the garden! Look at all the beautiful butterflies, trees and flowers! I love being in the garden! Look, I've collected a beautiful basket of flowers. Do you want to see them? I can't wait to show you. Can you figure out which flowers are in my basket? Let's begin. Hmm, what flower is this one? It's yellow. And it looks like a big sun. Is it a tulip? A rose? Or a sunflower? Yay, it's a sunflower! Woohoo! My favourite! What flower is this? Hmm, it's red. Is it a lotus? Or a lily? Is it a tulip? No! It's a rose! Yay! I'll give it to my loved ones. What flower is this? Hmm, that's pretty. Is it a daisy? Well, it's yellow, but I don't think so. Is it a lotus or a rose? Ah, oh, it's a lily. Wow. And what flower is this one? Any guesses? Hmm, is it a daisy? No. A sunflower. Uh-uh. Is it a rose? Nope. It's a lotus. Yay. How beautiful. How many other flowers do I have in my basket? Let's see. Hmm. I wonder. Which one is this? I know this one. Do you? Is it a daisy? Nope. A lily? Uh-uh. Or is it... An orchid. Yes, it is an orchid. Pretty in pink. I love orchids, my favourite. <laughs> what flower is this one? Hmm, it's not a sunflower or a lotus. Is it a lily? No. I know, it's a daisy. Yay, well done. You guessed all the flowers in my basket. Great job. I've had fun learning all the flower names, haven't you? Subscribe to Kent the Elephant for more learning videos. And until then, bye! the school
wash and get on our feet. Uh-huh. Let's wash our face and brush our teeth. The sun has risen, it's early morn. We gotta catch the school bus before it's gone. The sun has yeah. risen, it's early morn. We gotta catch the school bus before it's gone. Water is filling and bubbles rising. We go for a bath, singing and skipping. organ. Oh, I think I've spotted it. Did you? Time's up. That's right. The pink Tweety Bird is missing in the picture on the right. Let's go again. Can you find any differences? Let's count the butterflies. Time's up. That's right! There are four butterflies in the left picture and three in the right picture. Next, let's do this one. It's me! Hello! Can you find the difference? Ooh, this one's a bit trickier. It's hiding a bit. Time's up! That's right! In this picture, the picture of me is missing! Next is gonna be... Me! With my friend! Yay! We're doing some colouring. Can you spot the difference? Nearly there. Time almost gone. Time's up! Yeah! That's 
That's right! There's a crayon missing! Hmm, it's a lovely sunny day and we're all eating ice pops. Can you find any differences between the two pictures? Time's up! <laughs> That's right! In this picture, Monkey doesn't have his ice pop! <laughs> You did a great job spotting all the differences in those pictures. Well done! That was so much fun! Good job, kids! Yay! Hi, I'm Kent, Kent the Elephant. And today I'm going to build a house. How exciting! Will you help me? Yes? Wow! Let's get started! Ooh! There's the outline of the house. Let's fit different parts of the house right there. What goes where? Let's do the foundation first. Wow, that was so easy. Next, let's do the walls. Let's paint them. I love yellow. It looks great. Now, let's go for the roof. Brilliant. Perfect! It looks amazing! Now, what do we use to enter the house? A door! Yeah! Let's colour the door now! Now some lovely windows to look outside for the sunshine to come in! Next we need some steps! Perfect! And now, the chimney! Woohoo! This is such a beautiful home! What's missing? A small garden! Some plants, some hedges! Oh, how lovely! Oh, I know, how about a tree? Wow! My house looks so beautiful! Okay, kids, I'm going home! Bye-bye! See you! Hi, I'm Kent, Kent the Elephant, and I love fruit so much! I'm going to collect some. I would love if you would help me. Yay, let's go! Hmm, wait a minute. <gasps> what fruit is this? And where is it? Ah, I wonder which fruit fits in there. Hmm, is it a banana? <laughs> no, that doesn't fit in there. Um, how about a watermelon? No, definitely too big. Hmm, it could be an apple. Yes, it's perfect. Great job, thanks for your help. Hmm, here go all the apples into my wheelbarrow. <laughs> I love apples. Hmm, what fruit is this? Um, what could fit here? Which fruit would go in that tree? How about an orange? No, it's too round. It doesn't look right. What do you think? Could it be a watermelon? No, too big. Hmm. It looks kind of long shaped. Could it be grapes? No, that's not the right shape. It must be a banana. Let's see. Yes, it's perfect. It's a bunch of bananas. I love banana. Now, here go the bananas. <laughs> What's next? Ooh, these look big and they grow on the ground. What could they be? Could it be an apple? No, remember apples grow on the tree. It could be a banana. No, banana bunches grow on trees too. Hmm, maybe a watermelon. Yeah, it could be. Yes, it's a watermelon. Woohoo! Great job! Thank you, guys. Let's collect them in our wheelbarrow. Yay! 
Whoa, what fits here? There's lots and lots of them. I wonder what fruit that could be. Let's try. This looks like an apple. No, hang on a minute. We already did apples, although it looks kind of similar. Hmm. Maybe an orange. I think it could be an orange. Yes, it's round, just like an orange. Perfect. We did it, guys. Well done. Let's collect them in our wheelbarrow. Woohoo! <laughs> I can't wait to eat all these yummy fruits. Ooh, what's growing off this branch? Let's try. Hmm. How about a watermelon? Oh, no, no, remember? That grows in the ground. Hmm. Perhaps it could be an orange. No, that's too big. Didn't we just see an orange in the tree? Maybe some grapes, a bunch of grapes. Yes, a bunch of grapes grows on a vine. It's perfect. Well done. Yeah, and in they go. Yummy, yummy. I'm going to have such a fruit salad feast. Woohoo! There are all the fruits. We found them all. We had an apple, a banana, a bunch of grapes. An orange and a watermelon. Can't wait to eat my fruit salad. It's going to be amazing. I'm going to go now. Bye. Hi, kids. I'm Kent, Kent the elephant. Let us play a fun farm word puzzle game today. I love word puzzles. Let's get started. Yay. All we need to do is look for farm animal names in the puzzle. Easy peasy. Ooh, who is this? Uh, a cow! Can you help me look for the letters C, O and W? Where is C? There it is! Now let's look for the letter O. Can you help me find the letter C with the letter O? Where can you find them together? There it is! And that's W. We found cow. C-O-W. Cow. We did it. Wow. Let's do the next one. Ooh. Hmm. What animal is this? <gasps> A duck. We spell it D-U-C-K. Duck. Let's look for D. Hmm. Where is D? There it is. I found it. Woohoo! Next comes the letter U. Let's look for D and U together. Can you find it? There it is! Woohoo! We found it! D and U together! Next, we're going to look for C. It's right under U and K at the bottom. You got the whole word D U C K. Duck! Well done! Quack, quack! <laughs> what are we going to look for next? Hmm, a chicken! Oh, that's a long one! Starting with the letter C. Let's look for C. Um, where's C? I can see two. How about these two? Hmm, the next letter in the spelling is H for chicken ch hmm where's h look for an h next to c there it is next to the first c and the next letter is i then c k then e and n we found it well done kids it's chicken yay cluck cluck Woohoo! what's the next one this is so much fun hmm what could it be? Oh, it's, it's a horse! Yay! H-O-R-S-E Starts with the letter H Look for H Where's H? There it is! It's a red one! Yay! O is right next to it R and an S And an E H-O-R-S-E Yay! We found it! Horse! Whee! Brilliant! 
Last one. Okay, goat. <laughs> oh, that's an easy one. G is the first letter. Hmm, can you find G anywhere? <gasps> we found it. It's the purple one. Now, what's next? Hmm. O is next. Now, where is O? O is underneath G. It's the red one. A is underneath O and then T. Goat. G O A T. <laughs> Goat. Woohoo. <laughs> We solved the bar puzzle! This is so much fun! Right kids? For more fun learning videos, keep watching Kent the Elephant! Until then, bye bye Hi, I'm Kent! Whoa! What just happened here? My, my, my room is so messy! Will you help me? Come on, let's get started! I can't wait to clean my room spick and span. We have to pick up all my toys and put them back on the shelves. Ready then? Woohoo! My soccer ball! Ooh! And my two basketballs! Hmm. I wonder how many balls I can fit in my cupboard. How many are here so far? Will you help me count them? One soccer ball and two basketballs. One plus two is one, two, three. That's right. One plus two is three. Woohoo! We did it. We learned to add. Up they go on my shelves. My cars! Look how many cars I have! Red and yellow ones too! Wow! Vroom, vroom! Let's see! I have two red cars and two yellow cars! So how many could I fit in my cupboard? That's one, two, three, four! Two plus two is four! We got it! Yay! Vroom, vroom! Let's put them on our shelf! What next? Books! So, how many books? We've got so many! Three pink books and three blue books! Three plus three is... One, two, three, four, five, six! That's right! Three plus three is six! Brilliant! Well done! You're so good at adding! Let's put those on the shelf too! Right, let's mop the floor! What else can we find? How about some crayons? Yay! I've got so many crayons! Ooh! How many are there? How many can I fit in my drawer? Four green crayons and four blue crayons! One... Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Four plus four is eight. Good job. Well done. Wow. Up they go on the shelf. My room looks so clean now. Thanks for helping. Bye. you won't laugh I haven't any flowers I haven't any grass but now I'm going to dig and plant and soon I'll have a show with a bit of sun a bit of rain there'll be a lovely row of one pineapple two pineapple three pineapple four five pineapple six pineapple seven pineapple more one pineapple two pineapple three pineapple four five pineapple six pineapple seven pineapple you won't laugh. I haven't any green trees and I have a little grass. But now I'm going to dig and plant and soon I'll have a show. With a bit of sun, a bit of rain, there'll
Code accepted. Knees and toes, knees and toes, and I. 